Hello, welcome one, welcome all to my channel. I'm the Con Blessing Soul. Thank you for being here. <laughs> Felt a vibe to change it up a little bit for whatever reason. Sometimes you know you get those vibes, so I tend to follow them for whatever reason. Um, <laughs> um, maybe some of you are feeling the need to guard or protect your energy a little bit more. That's kind of the feeling. I do know there's supposed to be like really cool meteor showers right now. So the next couple of days, if you want to go out, you know, in the evening sky, see what you can see. It's supposed to be like really, really cool. Okay, we are reading from the Light Worker Oracle Guidebook, and we are on number 12. Eternal now. You can see that. 12 reducing to a 3. <laughs> I feel like he's blowing a kiss. But that's probably not the case. Maybe it is the case. <laughs> All right. Within you is great strength and courage. However, just because you can manage to keep going when you are drained or stressed, it doesn't mean you have to do so. You are encouraged by your higher guidance to request assistance and letting go of tension within your mind and body. You will gain energy through this release and perhaps even see things in a new and more optimistic light, shifting into a more present, relaxed, and enjoyable state of being will help you overcome the past and successfully create your future. Dear one, have your thoughts become trapped in the pain of the past? Have they been drifting towards possible futures? If too much of your energy is pulled away from the present moment, you diminish the power you have to create what your heart desires. Creation doesn't happen in the past or the future. It happens in the here and now by the choices you make in each moment. Even now, in reading this message, you are choosing to be present, to bring your energy into the eternal now, stimulating the law of attraction into action. As you relax in this moment, trusting that the past is over and the future shall truly be wonderful. You can more easily energize your dreams, visions, and heartfelt desires. The universe believes that you are deserving of a spiritual gift. To accept the gift in whatever form it takes, you will need to be present, to have enough stillness of mind to recognize it. You'll need to have enough inner peace to accept it, to take it inside where it can nourish, inspire, and heal you. The form of this gift will be perfect for you, and the way that it comes shall be perfect too. It is being orchestrated by divine timing now. It will assist you to take the next step on your soul journey successfully. Your gift might be a piece of guidance and inner knowing that changes your outlook permanently. It might help you truly know your heart, truly know in your heart that your divine destiny is already unfolding and your spiritual success is inevitable it is not a question of if only a matter of when 
Your gift might be an amazing opportunity that, opportunity that comes out of the blue. It could be a meeting that will prove significant to your unfolding life path. It could be a new relationship or new connection with a community. It might be a life-changing teaching, a deeply healing dream or an actual object. Spirit is unlimited in its willingness and ability to give to you. You need only be open to receive. And you do so by bringing yourself back to the present moment. Stillness of mind and inner peace. are only possible <laughs> when you are present in the eternal now. And I feel like I was a little bit distracted. I wasn't fully present. <laughs> Maybe that message is for me. Um, this is where you will find what you are seeking. So let the past be done and allow the future to take care of itself. Center your awareness in this moment. I don't know why I'm doing hand gestures, but I'm feeling like, okay. Um, maybe some of you need to do some Tai Chi, move the energy like I feel like. Um, anyways. Where was I? I'm very distracted. Allow the future to take care of itself. Create your awareness in this moment. You are safe. You are breathing gently now. You are here where you belong at exactly the right time. All things serve your greater good. Nothing is wrong. You are doing a fantastic job. All is in process. In this moment, there is just the peace and the comfort of the eternal now. Relax. Trust. Allow yourself to be nourished. If you've been worrying about the past or the future, this is a reminder to just let it be. All is working out just as it is meant to, even in the things you don't quite understand or find hard to accept. In time, you will know the perfection of all that is happening in your life. You'll feel so lucky, blessed, grateful, and truly loved. For now, however, it is enough to just be here and breathe. Before I read the invocation, I'm going to um, talk to you a little bit about a particular like breathing pattern that I like and I use often. I believe it's called the 468. I could be totally wrong, but it's where you inhale through your nose only, so not your mouth. Just through your nose, inhale for like four big seconds. Then you hold your breath for six. And then it's all through your nose. <laughs> if it's hard for me to talk, but you know. And then you're gonna exhale through your nose for eight seconds. Then you repeat the four, hold for six, exhale for eight. So four, six, eight, four, six, eight. It's supposed to really help you if you're stressed or anxious or just need like a calming minute or just need to bring yourself back to the now. Anyways, <laughs> breath is so important and sometimes we don't always connect to it. Here's the invocation. I give myself permission to be free from past pain 
and future worry. There's so much goodness and so many gifts for me now. I choose to dwell in the peace of this moment where all is unfolding according to secret divine perfection. My unique divine destiny is manifesting with loving care. I open to the relief and reassurance that comes to me now. I am loved and provided for, and all is happening for my greatest fulfillment. I invite divine, unconditional love to awaken peace in my heart and in the hearts of all beings through my own free will. So be it. <laughs> well, I hope this message from eternal now find you all healthy and happy and in a good and in a good place protect yourself protect your energy do what you need to do um, for self-care get out there and try and catch a cool meteor shower it's really kind of cool maybe you'll see a shooting star you can make a wish <laughs> Anyways, may you always find yourself in the light. Much love and many blessings.